anyways okay so it is our first proper day in barcelona we did get here quite early yesterday but we hadn't slept because we had to get the bus to dublin at half one in the morning to get our flight so basically we just didn't sleep for a long time so we kind of just came for our first day chilled a little bit had a bit of a nap and got some food so this is our first proper day and it's nice and sunny today so we're going to go out and today we're going to explore the gothic quarter we did go last time we were here and we had a good walk around it last night whenever we went out to get food but i am really excited to show you guys because it's just it's so pretty you'll see what i mean in a minute so let's go okay my goodness it's bright but i don't want to put on my sunglasses and dent my makeup so we are just walking through this park here do you remember what this park's called um i'll figure it out anyway but this like this park is one of my favorite places in the world i love oh there's a giant dragon flying over there oh my goodness yeah i love this park so so much it's just so nice and i'm going to show you the fountain in the middle which is like my favorite thing in my favorite park so let's go see that this is the problem <laughs> That's us kind of coming into the main part of the Gothic Quarter now. You can see it down behind me. And yeah, I'm really excited to show you guys because just everywhere here is so, so pretty. Like every building, every balcony, everything is just gorgeous. So we're gonna have a little walk around. So we're just toodling on through the Gothic Quarter, you turn a corner. Bam! Huge, cool church cathedral type thing. I love this place so much. You don't understand. There's so many cool little quirky shops. There's delicious food everywhere. There are a thousand dogs. There's so many, so many dogs in Barcelona. Let's cut to a clip of some of the dogs. I just really 
love it. And there's plants everywhere. And you know how I feel about plants. I'm gonna cry. I love it here. What's this? I trust him with my goddamn life. With your dog and life. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at this. Oh my god. What did we turn into? Yeah, what like the this. Hell? How did we... I like I wish I could I'm, I'll try to find out what this place is called to tell you guys, but we just walked into like a random little place and it was just full of all the coolest stuff. I don't know what's happening, but it's really cool. Because Ryanair is stupid with their luggage policy, we have like no room in our luggage, like we have to fill it. So we can't really buy anything while here and it's so frustrating. Look! Oh my god. Is that an Edward Scissorhands like latte? El Dementor. El Dementor. Guys, I'm losing my mind. Oh no. Okay, so we're in this place. Oh, I already mentioned it. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> I am so upset. Guys, I'm losing my freaking mind. Oh, okay. Cool. All I can see is you in the reflection. I can't actually see the stuff in there. Oh, it's Dracula clothing. Wow, to the front. That's so cool. Oh my god, what the hell? Where are we? Oh my god. Cadmium Rose? Oh, I've heard of them. Oh, I think that they were at... Um, Oh my god, they were at London Edge! Really? Yes! I think maybe the first one we went to? I remember talking to they them. Until four. Heck! Yeah, no, I really liked their stuff. I always find like a cool pro- everywhere's closed. I think everyone must be out on lunch break. Lunch, yeah. But yeah, look, there's like cool, like this belt with bottles and like little potions and like prop weapons. It's called prop corn. Prop corn. So bloody cool. I- oh, there's like a leaky, leaky cauldron set. Oh my god, there's like a Hufflepuff gauntlet over there. Look at this cool belt with lots of little bottles. I would like find a way to actually use that just in daily life. There's a Star Wars shop. Why did no one tell me about this place? Yeah, what the fuck? Oh my god, look at this nice Niffler boy. Oh. Huh? oh my god, there's a what? Right, hold on, I'm coming, but first look at this Niffler. Bam! Look at the Niffler before I scream. Oh my god, that's a really good Niffler. That's so cute. Okay, okay. Am I about to lose my mind? Yep, I'm about to lose my mind. Up in here, up in here. Oh my god. These are perfect witch heads oh that I've been looking for. Totoro. Oh my god, cute. Cute, 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 cute. Where's the one I have? <gasps> Good look. God, I want one. I want to be Quidditch Seeker. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> yeah, this is all like specialist, equi like collector's equipment. I think this is all the noble collection stuff. It's a little covered in his stick. <laughs> I genuinely want this. I love that. Yes, this place is open now. Oh, I want to go. Oh, it's restyle. I love that corset. Look. Oh, I remember seeing these earrings before. You walk out of the arcade place and you're immediately greeted with this. Oh my gosh. Look at the pigeon butts. <laughs> 
are you filming? Hey! <laughs> Excuse me. That's Barcelona government posted this. Surely not. Someone must have just made a fucking stamp like with their thing. This is so satisfying. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love all these <laughs> shops that are just full of like fucking <clears throat> cool shit like sextants and compasses mm -hmm. and old worldy Especially stuff. Sextants. <laughs> Look at this. I want a house full of this crap. Can we just take a moment to appreciate how pleasant this is? I don't know if you guys are super bored of me showing you pretty buildings and alleyways and balconies yet, but I honestly can't explain how warm all of this makes my heart. I don't know why, I just love it. Look at all the freaking plants. It oh. hits my knees. <laughs> it, makes it makes me wheeze. <laughs> and in the summer, I'm afraid of bees. No, running is not for me. <laughs> Leave a comment if you know what that reference is. There's sexy bridges. <laughs> There's so many cool shops here. This, for reference, is basically what I want my living room to look like. Stop coughing on my camera. Yeah, I just want my living room to look like this. Just piles of pretty trinkets and 20 books. Degrees. Is it 20? Wow. Look. Oh, I want a fancy writing set. I don't, you guys know I don't like writing by hand, but I want it. This is the shop for reference. Paper Barium. Wow. So, we were just toodling along and somehow popped out on Les Rambles, or Les Rambler. I keep forgetting which one it is, but yeah, I didn't realize we'd walked over this way. <laughs> We've just been wandering around for so long. But yeah, so, do you guys remember a couple of videos ago when I said we were coming here, I mentioned the really cool, the really cool, like, bar cafe thing that's all like an enchanted forest. This is what it's called, and it's down here. So this is the sign for it, and it's in there. We will probably go there later. But right now we need food. I'm sorry to tease you. <laughs> I love it. Smack. I love it here. Uh. I am so happy we got what I have been dreaming of, and we're saying idiot, by the beach. So I am delighted. So this is a lake that's been drained recently, and there's just one sad goose, and it looks like he's just sitting in the middle of it like, where'd my water go? <laughs> okay, so we were super, super tired. After all that, we did a lot of walking, so we went back to the house for a little while just to chill, sit down, have a little relax, but now we're back out, we're feeling peckish, and we want something sweet, so what are we getting? Gelato. Because it's like everywhere here. We went to one little place that was super near us, but didn't have any of the good flavors, so we're gonna find a good place. I forgot there's one of these places here. It's like you have your food in the dark, which I don't know, I think it'd be kind of cool, but also, I th think would bother me. I'm not sure, but I like the idea of it. So this building actually has real gargoyles on it. Oh, really? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you yelling? You can kind of see. Yeah, there's one. So yeah, the difference is gargoyles are the ones specifically that water comes out of. The statues you see that look similar that don't have water are actually called grotesques.
was pretty cool. We just went into that big old cathedral there. And yeah, that was just beautiful. So, so amazing. Like, I wonder how long it took to build something like that, or how they even built something like that. It's crazy to me, but it's just so ornate and pretty. So, that was awesome. Uh, I think we are going to head back towards the park now, yes. I don't smoke. I don't like guns. And yet I still find myself wanting this because of my ridiculousness. <laughs> so we just had some food and now we are walking back home and this place is possibly even prettier at night. I don't know. I can't decide because now there's pretty lights but during the day there's sun so it's honestly hard to decide. There's more dogs. I love dogs. There's so many dogs. Dog panic. All the dogs are mad. Uh, yeah, so we were just having a nice little toodle back through the street, so I guess I'll show you a little bit of the Gothic Quarter at night on our way back here. Isn't that pretty? Mm. And that was our first day, well first proper day in Barcelona. There are a couple of clips kind of spliced in there that were taken on other days as we were walking around, but since it was, you know, like the Gothic Quarter vlog, I just threw them in there. We've been home for two or three days now, I think. I am still Everything's in chaos. I haven't even unpacked, so. Um, but it was an amazing trip. Um, I forgot to end it properly, like the vlog while we were out there. So I'm just doing this a little bit now to wrap it up. Um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed it. If you're wondering about the like magical enchanted fairy cafe, don't worry, that is part of another vlog that'll be along very soon. Uh, we did go and I did vlog it, it's just that's on a different day. But yeah, Barcelona is just a fantastic city and I especially love that little area that we were exploring. We ended up there pretty much every day. We spent a lot of our time just wandering around there. Uh, we did go up and down around some of the other parts, like the more modern parts and stuff. I just love those little streets. There's a lot of like cool little unique stores, a lot of handmade stuff. You know, there's so much good food from like a lot of different cultures and stuff. Dogs and plants everywhere. And yeah, it was just pretty amazing. Honestly, like walking through that area sometimes was just like, it was like sensory overload. Like I felt high or something. I think it was just, there's just so much. There's just so much to see. There's all the different sounds, all the different smells, usually good, not always, but there's, you know, like a lot of smells of like all the different little pastry shops and restaurants and like chocolate places and stuff. And just, I don't know, like all of it comes together and I would just be wandering around just loopy from how much I loved everything. So I really enjoyed it. I want to go back as soon as possible. It was just oh, definitely the most sort of relaxed and happy that I have felt in a long time. So I appreciate that. Yes, as I say, I really hope you enjoyed this. I would love it if you could like leave a comment and let me know what you thought. I don't know, like vlogs are some of my favorite to make, so I just really like extra appreciate feedback and stuff on them. Just like, just comments, just like tell me stuff. I don't know, I just, I enjoy doing them. Um, a lot of the time I'll struggle to put them together because I'm just like, there's so much footage, I don't know where it goes. I record, recorded 20 gigabytes of footage when we were away. So I was just like, <laughs> so you know, I don't always get my vlogs done whenever I mean to, but like whenever I really think about it, they are some of my favorites, so I'd love to hear back from you. I will have more along shortly. I'm gonna try to just get them all done while I'm 
riding a wave of motivation so they're ready to go. So if you enjoyed this vlog, give it a thumbs up so that I know. As I say, leave a comment. I would love to hear from you. That would be awesome. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe or you can check out some other videos first and see what you think, but we would love to have you as part of the family. If you do subscribe, remember to hit the bell notification so you know when new videos come out. And finally, if you could check out my Patreon, that would be amazing. Patreon is an awesome website that lets you tip your favorite creators for the content that they make for you. And since YouTube is a wasteland of broken dreams. It is how I support myself. So thank you so much to everyone who is on there. You're all awesome and I would love to see some new faces over there too. Okay, I'm off. I have much to do today. I've just realized that I don't know what suitcase my camera charger's in. So once this battery dies, I'm gonna have a problem, but we'll figure that out later. <laughs> so I will see you next time. Bye lovelies. Thank you.